swear the craziest thing happened at the Asian massage parlor. Oh, really? shit. What happened? happened? Alright, here's how it went down. I don't mean to complain, but I got a couple problems. A lot of equations, but no one to solve them. I carry all the stress like a pack on my back. I'm needing a massage and the tension will relax. So I ask, what's the best value for my dollar? And all the signs point, Asian massage parlor. Unmarked building, I see no signs of life. Still, I walk in the door, it smells like rice. I say I'm stressed. The lady behind the counter says, we make you happy, $60 an hour. She checks my wallet, make sure I have enough. Fair price, I'd say, if you include enough to buy. Pass right through, we'll be with you in a second. Sounds nice, but there was some shit she didn't mention, so I'll wait. For the happy ending to my stress, when in marks a scaly dragon in his breath. Remove your clothes, breathing fire as she spoke. Nervously, I strip till my body is exposed. Go through the door and just lay on the bed. Hurry your ass up, or I'll slice off your puny head. Which head she meant, she never did say. But I slid into the room and silently obeyed. And there I lay, waiting without a word. When a lady walks in with a flaming sword, she bellows and swings, aiming at my little fellow. And I scream like a bitch as I dodge the metal. I got a samurai chick trying to cut off my dick. And the witnesses for court, I gotta leave quick. So I run for the door, stop by another lady. Are you ready for the massage? Oh, don't be a little baby. That's just a cleaning woman, she can be a little crazy. She's harmless though. Well, maybe. Samurai bitch leaves, staring at me as she goes. I lie flat on the table and I'm ready for the show. This won't hurt a bitch, she happily lies. And she's punched me so hard I cry. It was manly tears, so don't judge me, asshole. <laughs> she starts to wail on every inch of my back. I'm yelling pretty loud, you can still hear the crack. She's charging up a fist and she's aiming for my nuts. I evade. This isn't what I meant by bust. I run out the door, trying to end my trip. And I hear in the background, you forgot the tip. I run out the place and I call it a day. When I find I'm face to face with a soldier made of clay. Think it's cool not to tip? That shit isn't funny. Tips are their primary source of money. He pulled out his dick, so I drew mine. I wasn't gonna get pushed around this time. We clashed our swords, but his was too strong. I was wheeling on the ground from the ceramic schlong. I was gonna die, so I had to think and realize his armor had a chink. I took careful aim and unleashed my spring. A viewer on his face, and it really seemed to work. He started melting. He was like, ah, and I got ready to give the coup de gras. I pumped all my blood, prepared my final attack, and I pulled my dick back, and I swung it with a whack. Clay broke the pot, he was vaporized. I spent the rest of the day cleaning clay from my eyes. And so I learned a lesson, it's all I have to say. If you're trying to bust a nut, you really shouldn't pay. Hey, yo, taste the greatness. My story, it, it was exactly the same. Well, no, it wasn't. But it was, it was something like this. It goes one dollar, two dollar, three dollar, four. I'm craving Chinese food. And I'm in the wrong store I walk up to the counter To order some sweet and sour Asian lady at the front said Welcome to my fast pie. I shake my head puzzle Thinking this isn't right Ticked off about the fact That every Asian looks alike As I turn around I brought it to leave She said Silly nigga happy And think property I'm trying to chill Someone said I have a seat My star ring takes a pause I was in for a treat As I headed to the back My anxiety arose A hood of men appeared Told me to take off on my clothes What the fuck? Being new wasn't my plan He removed the hood It was fucking Jackie Chan Two kicks my stomach hit the mat, struck me with quick chop to massage my back. For a moment he stopped and threw the curtains for Bruno. Now Bruno wasn't small, he was a motherfucker too. My arms around on my body, then he squeezed my back. My face started to cringe as I hear my spine tap. I scream, stop! Let his grip go in his grave. My body fell numb from the stomach to the waist. Fucking free massage, get back there in the ear. Snap their fingers, smoke a rose, and they somehow disappear. I grabbed my clothes, respect the counter, I was done. The lady at the front, yeah. No, he fucked! the ending, that's how my story concludes. And I still didn't get my fucking Chinese. I don't know, you guys gotta hear my trip to the Asian Massage Parlor. I mean, y'all's was crazy, but this is crazy. This was a great day, a blessing indeed. I won a ticket to something I need. A shop next to Penn's Landing Harbor and shirt was a trip to the Asian Massage Parlor. I made my voyage and I walked through the door, but as soon as I was in, I hit the floor. I thought I was clumsy, but I turned around to see a greedy Asian woman on the ground. I want to hit. So I looked her in the eyes, I compliment her smile, facing lovely guys, she gave you a lot. He he, black man funny. She grabbed me by the hand, but she didn't mess her money. She took me in the back, laid me on the table. Thanks for moving real steady, but my dick was unstable. She taking off my shirt, things started getting heated, but I got so excited, I motherfucking skied. I screamed, I didn't mean it, you're so goddamn pretty. She looked me in the eyes and said, you're too shitty. Thanks to you, not my floor on dirt. Don't blame me, lady, it's your fault for flirting. For bringing me shame, you have to pay debt. This was no average pet, not hog, no gorilla. This creature was huge, she had called Godzilla. She had no control, for this monster was insane. Aiming to kill and shot out deadly flames. I rolled to the corner to find an escape, but the exit to the place was bent out of shape. As I gave up the hope, I fell to the wall, and I saw to the right, 
sticky white ball. It was my ski, but a way out too. There was a great power in the sticky white glue. I picked it up and made a mighty toss. It hit him in his eye, so his bounce head lost. Made a big trip and hit his head. X is in his eyes, he was pronounced dead. Lady on the death of a monster's beast. So I grabbed her hand to cheer her up at least. Smile on her face, all the wounds are finished. Nothing so I whispered in her ear. Can I get a happy ending? And that's how I got this black eye. That's pretty epic. No, it's not. Fuck the Asian massage parlor. I want my fucking Chinese food. Why does it give me some now? Asian, Asian massage, massage parlor. parlor. Man, I ain't want no happy ending. I want some general soul chicken.